Michael has had mould problems in his flat for 20 years, no matter what he does to try and fix it. Washed it with bleach, painted it, just keep cleaning it, you know, as much as it just keeps coming back and back. Like the kitchen, where it's coming back again after it being painted, only there at Christmas. Now the bathroom is very sane. Residents in Oliver Bond flat complex have launched a campaign for better housing with 83% of them reporting mould in their homes and two-thirds concerned about crime. We've been listening to this about ten, for 10 years. Now they're saying it's going to take another four years for it to start and then 15 years for it to complete. People can't live in the, the conditions that our basic human rights are not being met in the conditions that we're living in, so people can't wait for, for, that, for that length of time to get their houses up to standard. Experts say the conditions that some people are living in are unacceptable. There's flats where they can be easily remediated by certain measures, maybe like putting in a better ventilation system, and then the flats that actually have gone beyond a point where in fact they're, they're potentially damaging health. And I think there needs to be a clear line that people in those flats actually need to leave those flats. They need to be accommodated elsewhere while significant work is done, not just paint work. Dublin City Council says the regeneration of Oliver Bond is a priority and that interim works will resume once Level 5 restrictions are lifted. John Corain, RT News, Dublin.